Well, this is an amazing female bonding film, I yes. think. It's pretty yes. awesome. But did you find that there was a lot of freedom, being that this is an R-rated movie, to do things that you couldn't do in your TV show? Definitely. You know, when you're in an R-rated movie, you do have that freedom. And I think sometimes the instinct is to really milk it and go crazy right away. And I think Jason Moore did a really awesome job at making sure that we weren't losing it all. You know what I mean? He would basically come over and be like, hey, you don't have to be at 10 at this scene. And I think if you calibrate that the right way, then when Tina or Amy do drop an F-bomb or something, it's so much more powerful than if it's just everyone's like, the whole movie, F, S, F, 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 you know? So he really did a great job at making sure that we were not just completely immersing ourselves into that kind of crazy, dirty world. He really made it sure it was balanced, I think. Well, what I love about your scenes is that First of all, there were some of the most hilarious scenes in the movie. <laughs> the way that you played everything off, and you're right, it was just kind of like a line here and a line there. It seemed like such a blast. How did you keep a straight face during the filming? I didn't. There are there some scenes where I just could not keep a straight face. Where And Amy and Tina are so professional, and they're just so good at that. And there were times where I just kept laughing. And a couple times where Jason's like, hey, kind of keep your shit together. And when, I'm sorry, I couldn't say, uh, you can bleep it, you can pixelate it and bleep it up. <laughs> but also when you're working with someone who's so professional, and they, they aren't breaking. Like Mindy and I sometimes are not professional when we're on our show and you're just flat out laughing. But I think it's a little bit different in a movie. You have more time constraints, you're shooting on film, blah, 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 blah. So uh, yeah, we were able to have our fun but not uh, get too wrapped up in it. So what made you want to play this character in this film? I what mean, is it about the script? The script was so funny. I, I, I've been such a fan of Paula Pels for so long. And when I read the script, not only was it funny, but it really, really had just a great emotional core and it had a lot of heart. And I think sometimes movies are either or. You see a movie that's really funny, but it's kind of just fluffy and airy and too much light. Or uh, you get a movie that's like very heavy and dark and they say it's a comedy, but it's not a comedy because there's nothing funny in it. And this really walked that line of kind of being both. So it was kind of that combined with being Amy's boyfriend in a movie, which I've been friends with her for so long and working with Tina and Maya and Jason. It was just like, there was like 16 reasons why I wanted to do this movie. So I was watching this movie with my sister, and when that event happened, yes. my sister almost lost her mind. Oh she was like, that is so emotional. So when you read that in the script that you'd have to play that, what were yes. you thinking? Uh, I was thinking, I wish we shot this scene right now. Like, I, I, that, you know, when you're an, uh, if you're a, com a comedic actor, you look for those moments, and they make you so excited and so on board that it's, it, it kind of almost consumes you. And, you know, I think some serious actors, like, I can't imagine, like... Uh, Ryan Gosling would be like, yeah, that, 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 that'll be good. You know what I mean? Like, you want to get a comedy guy who's like, yes, that is going to be a laugh. That is going to go in my body. Let's make it happen. And there's so many fun, playful elements in this film. What was some of your favorites? I mean, you know, sometimes you just get hung up in the small moments. Like, uh, the scene where Amy comes to ask me to the party. I have this really fat dog in the movie. I don't know if you remember this. My, my dog's really overweight. And while we're trying to kind of you know, have this like kind of cute flirty scene. There's this like obese dog is going like, ah, ah, ah. so we just, it just kind of like, I just remember laughing. I couldn't kind of stop from laughing just because you're watching this like giant dog have a heart attack while you're trying to be romantic and light and funny. But and so it's just those small moments where you're just like, oh my God, this is so much fun.